The Veo 3.0 has intuitive settings menus that are controlled with its three buttons. From left to right, we have the minus button, the advance button, and the select button. Each button has two states. A simple push for less than two seconds, let's call this press, and a push and hold for two or more seconds, let's call this hold. The Veo main menu contains several submenus, but in this video we will cover only the ones related to its settings. They include set oxygen mix, set alarms, set utilities, set time, set operating mode, and reset. To access the main menu of the Veo, you must be at the surface. You can navigate the main menu using either the Advance button or the Minus button. Every time you press the Advance button, you move to the next submenu in the list. Every time you press the Minus button, you move to the previous submenu in the list. To enter a submenu, press the Select button. Once you're inside a submenu, you can step back to the main menu level by holding the select button. Note that when you step back, your settings will be ignored. Another way to navigate to the main menu is by scrolling. If you hold the advance button, the veil will automatically scroll to the list of submenus. Release the advance button to stop in front of the submenu you would like to enter. Then press the select button to enter it. If you hold the minus button, the veil returns to the main surface screen. Let's now look at the Set F submenu. This submenu is mainly used when planning a nitrox dive. To enter the Set F submenu while at the surface, press either the Advance button or the Minus button until you see Set F on the screen. Then press the Select button. The Set F submenu has three submenus, Set FO2 Gas 1, Set FO2 Gas 2, and Set 50% Default. Let's look at the first one, the Set FO2 Gas 1 submenu. Press Select to enter it. You can use this submenu to program the fraction of oxygen, FO2, in your primary tank. The default FO2 setting for Gas 1 for each new activation period is Air. When FO2 Gas 1 is set for Air, O2 data and MOD will not be displayed. To change the FO2 value, press either the Advance or the Minus button until you see the desired value on the screen. Let's set it to 32%. When FO2 Gas 1 is set for a numerical value, the dive is considered Nitrox and the NX icon will be displayed. This screen contains the following information. Max depth allowed for the PO2 alarm set, NX icon, Gas 1 tank icon, PO2 alarm value set with PO2 and max icons, flashing numeric FO2 set point value if nitrox, and FO2 icon. Hold the select button to ignore the value and to step back into the set F submenu, or press the select button to save the value and move to the set FO2 gas 2 submenu. In this video, we have given you an overview of the Oceanic Veo 3.0 settings. To learn more about the Veo 3.0, take the Veo 3.0 online specialty class at divecomputertraining.com. To practice with the Veo 3.0, use the eDiving Scuba Diving Simulator.